Don't you know I'm loco? Cause we be done so diving Uh-huh The ladies think we jiving Oh yeah It makes us feel alive when We eat We drive a jet of trash bins So don't judge We can say this a vampire Days since I've been in here. There's another one of those things. Oh, ooh, doing this. bugs nothing in there for us today nothing Let's see what they got here <laughs> nothing first time we've ever not gotten anything out of there that's the dumpster where the mound of clothes came from dumpster we used to get all the candy from Yesterday it was empty. Today it is packed full of candy, but I can't get it. They cut every bag open. They cut every bag, so anything that's individually wrapped, I'm trying to get. Bring me the other grabber. Oh, hurry up, hurry up. We got as much as we could. Not being able to climb in and out of the dumpster. I got what I could get with the grabbers. They cut every bag, but anything that was individually wrapped is still gonna be good. Now over here, I don't know if you can see or not, some other divers. That store, these dumpsters, most of these are for lease. Okay. That one's a restaurant. Here's our makeup store. Okay, I wanna tell him. They're in our pet dumpster right now, so. Lots of cardboard. Today is cardboard day. Yeah. Because the other stuff was already here. So cardboard would be the only new stuff. It's just cardboard. There's a restaurants and closed businesses. Pull up next to him so I can get out and tell him. They may just be looking for... They got four bags of dog food. Okay. Yeah, they got the... That's why we, when we come Good up, it's stop. always empty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just tell them we're not intruding. She just wants to let them know about all the candy. <laughs> yeah, she just let them know there's a bunch of candy down there they can you grab. Too. Now they just came from this way, so mm -hmm. I wonder if they hit the oh, if they hit oh, the grocery oh, store or not. She had flowers. She had flowers. Mm -hmm. She's most, most likely already got it. But we can stop and take a look and see if there's anything that... Maybe there's something that they didn't want that we do. So let's take a look. I'm going to check out the TJ Maxx there, but that's just cardboard and styrofoam because they put a new compactor. And that couple just came from here. So I'm not expecting to find anything. 
but I'm gonna take a look just in case those are nasty. Oh, it stinks so bad in here. Uh, that could be neat, but it stinks too bad. I mean. that grayish brown more gray than brown hamburger down the bottom that's why it's thinking this is always plastic and styrofoam because they got a compactor now yep they beat us here everything was pretty rank anyway all right How's everyone doing? You like candy? We got some candy. Mungo like candy. Shot a little bit of the dive. Couldn't shoot very much. I gave you a little peek. But the only way I was going to get any of that is if I sat the phone down. So I sat the phone down. This is what we ended up getting. First, let's go to the non-candy items real quick. I made a comment in my last vid, which I actually haven't quite finished yet, so it'll probably, for you guys, it'll be my next vid, about how we never find any games. Well, we found Boogie. That's right. Get up and boogie. On the Wii. Well, for the Wii, rather. And it is in there. And I already checked it. It's in good shape. So we got that. Got another Wii base. So now I have like four of these. Three that I found in dumpsters and one that came with my Wii. Got the nifty Wii gun controller accessory. You put the nunchuck right there, you put the controller right there, and then you then you go and you shoot stuff. So there's there's that stuff. We got another trash can. Can never have too many trash cans. I, I guess you can, but we haven't got to that level yet. So we got another trash can. It's really dirty inside because it, it sat out in the rain. I guess they put it out yesterday because it rained yesterday. But we know there's no holes in it or nothing because it held all that water. But we dumped it out. We're going to spray it out later on. Just trying to get the video done. Okay, now to the good stuff. Candy. <laughs> it's like candy. I really wish I wouldn't have used all of my candy related insert clips on my last candy video because that was a really lame candy haul and this one was actually pretty decent. Candy Mountain, Candy Mountain, you fill me with sweet sugary goodness. Go they cut open okay now this is from a place where we've gotten several bags of candy in the past you guys have seen some of the bag some of the well if you guys watch the videos you guys have seen some of the bags that we've gotten we had the three big bags of the gum well we had a, a big bag of assorted candies uh, yeah they've never they've never opened or cut anything but this well, they, they saw us. I know they did. Because one day we were there. I turned around and there was a face in the window on the back door looking at us. And apparently they were upset because now they cut everything. But anyway, they, they cut all the packages open. But it's all individually wrapped. And this was hilarious. They they took the time. They, and you can guess how many bags they cut open. We put it all in Ziplocs because the bags were all packed up. 
But they took the time to cut all these bags of candy open so that they could put them all in a nice, clean <laughs> trash bag, set the trash bag in that nice, easy-to-grab-and-carry container, and lowered it into the dumpster. <laughs> well, in the video, it, it does look like just a pile on the floor. But, yeah, I, I went digging at that pile and found out that that green container was under that pile. And most of it was actually in that green container. <laughs> um, but most of what we got was in that. We got maybe a third or a fourth of the candy that was in the dumpster. We got all we could with the grabbers because I can't climb in and out. That, and that was a pretty tall dumpster too. And um, as we were diving, we looked down the street at the next dumpster we were headed to. And there was a couple in that dumpster grabbing some pet food out. So we stopped there on the way by and we said, hey, you need to hit that dumpster over there. Candy haul from hell. So, and we told them there's still plenty there for them to grab. And they sounded really excited about that. They, they actually thanked us for not taking it all. But yeah, they got, if they got the rest of what was in there, they got a haul three times this size. So let's take a look see here. This is the only one that's still in the original bag. It is cut open and they're all individually wrapped and fine. Even the one that I just do on the floor. <laughs> but um, yeah, apparently the Heath miniatures, they didn't have very many of them to get rid of. So either they sell really good there or I don't know. But yeah, we got those. Those are pretty good. I liked them. Now, Butterfingers. Better not lay a finger on my Butterfinger. Nobody better lay a finger on my Butterfinger. Any of them. Any of these three bags. Three, three, three bags. <laughs> you can tell these are gallon sized bags. So, these two bags here probably got, what, maybe five or six of this size bags in there. You can see. They are packed full, and it is heavy. Well, you can't see it's heavy, but I'm, <laughs> I'll tell you, it's heavy. Whoa, this is heavy. There's a lot, a lot of candy in there. That one, you can't really tell, because it's got that big white mark. Take the bag there. Look at that. Butterfinger. And then this one's only half full, because those two are full. But we got that much more. <laughs> I already showed you the Heath. This is, um, these are, my flash is really reflecting off this plastic. That kind of sucks. Sorry about that. These are uh, green apple sour, uh, like twisty lollipops. I don't remember the brand. They were in a bag. The bag was cut open pretty bad. A lot of them fell out. We grabbed what we could, shoved them in here. They're pretty good. Pretty tasty. We got a full bag, just like the Butterfinger was, of Baby Ruth. And a little over a half bag to go with that. We got a full can't fit any more in and still zip lock it closed bag of the miniature three musketeers and sandwich bag full sandwich bag about half full so what wouldn't fit in this bag so we got that much of the three musketeers we only got one sandwich bag worth of, of Twix so apparently they only had, like the Heath, they had this one bag of the Heath, which is actually, I haven't weighed it, but I have a feeling this is like a bag and a half or so. And I wasn't done, but okay. But, uh, yeah, the, she says that there was only one bag of the Twix because the Twix are her favorite. And that's why there's only one bag of these. But she likes those two. And we both like those. 
I like those. She doesn't know yet. That's my absolute favorite. But since I lost my teeth, I can't eat them anymore. I'll find them eventually. <laughs> Let's see, what else? Uh, right here. Right, how about this big giant bag right here? Anyone care for some uh, neckers? Okay. Now these ones with just the single letters that you can actually lay out and spell out the word Snickers. These were introduced as Snickers Minis. And then these ones say Snickers Minis and are in like a gold wrapper instead of brown. I don't know if they just changed their packaging or if there actually is a difference. I sized them up and they're the exact same size. But anyway, full bag. Couldn't squeeze another one in there of Snickers. Original classic Hershey's milk chocolate. Everyone's all-time favorite. Now, there was enough of these in there to fill five of these gallon bags. But this is all I was able to get without climbing in. I wasn't able to climb in, so I'm happy I got these because that's a decent size. You know, that's a decent amount for, you know, for free can't complain we got two sandwich bags worth of Jolly Rancher suckers at first we thought they were uh, either charms or blow pops but no they're Jolly Ranchers which we're happy about because the Jolly Rancher ones are much better than the charms or the blow pops in our opinion so we got these two pretty packed sandwich baggies full of these we had a few that wouldn't fit in these but it was only like six of them so they're in they're in the candy container over over there ready for the kids to dig in and start eating got one and a half sandwich baggies worth of the Hershey milk chocolate nuggets. And I don't know. I ran out of bags. So we got this Tupperware so container nice. here. You can see about how big it is there. There was two of the bags themselves that these came in that they were cut just like this and I had filled them up and they were so full I couldn't squeeze any more in and then we found um, as we were digging we found a whole lot more so they're all in there and these are the Hershey nuggets with almonds so this is just milk chocolate this is milk chocolate with almonds and when I bite into one of these I feel like I just ate a York peppermint patty and that's that's really about it. I don't I don't like have visions of skiing or anything cuz that's just too much work and I, I get tired. So there were three of these boxes in there. One was completely empty. This one was about this full and then there was one that was this full. I took the one that was this full, poured it into this one. And then as we were sorting through the bag and container of everything, we found some more. And you can see there's a lot in there. That is more than the 175 that the box advertises. So we got some York Peppermint Patties. We got some Hershey Nuggets with almonds. We got some Hershey Nuggets regular. We got some Jolly Rancher Pup sucker things <laughs> not popsicles suckers got some regular Hershey got some Snickers got some Twix got some Three Musketeers got some Baby Ruth got some Butterfinger got some Heath got some Boogie I don't think you need any more chocolate Boogie Boogie Boogie, boogie. boogie on my finger and
and I can't shake it off. <laughs> Your trash can. You're not eating any more chocolate. Well, now I get to clean all this up so I can. We still haven't laid out all the the clothes yet to shoot a video of that. I have that video, it's all put together. It's all edited, ready to go. All I need to do is get the haul part, tap it onto the end of it, and then that one will be up. This one will most likely be up first because, well, I got done with it quicker. Anyway, till next time, you know, subscribe, like, comment, share, um, anything else you want to do with it, you know, all that happy dappy YouTube stuff, tell your friends, tell your enemies, <laughs> tell the world, but don't tell the stores where we dive at because then they'll, they'll start messing stuff up. I almost forgot to mention these. My personal favorite, the white chocolate Reese cups, and her personal favorite, the dark chocolate Kit Kat. All this candy we found, all these thousands of pieces of every type, and my favorite kind has two pieces, and her favorite kind had one. I had to include that because, I mean, seriously? 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 How did they throw out one dark chocolate Kit Kat and 10,000 Baby Ruth and 20,000 Butterfingers? It was Obviously, good. those are exaggerated numbers. It was I'm not so counting. Eat it. But yeah, that was kind of funny there. Yeah. A single dark chocolate. It's because we don't eat it. What? Okay. Added that in there. So anyway, till next time. Peace.